On this edition of Check 6 Aviation, we're planning for Oshkosh. What's going on, my friend? We're here at the big show, the daddy of them all as far as air shows go. We're here at Oshkosh, Wisconsin at Whitman Field. And let me tell you, this is 2022 as of this filming and the excitement is already high. Uh, I, I hear the, the Bell helicopter roaming around, you know, the five minute flight from, you know, the, the, the helicopter that they used in the beginning of MASH. Uh, so I'm, I'm excited to get out there on the grounds and get the party started. But with this video, especially if you've never been here before, then you're going to know want to know what to bring, but I'm not going to cover that because Plane Lady, if you see up here, has already covered that video, the, the top five things that you want to bring to Oshkosh. And she does mention what I'm going to cover briefly, but I'm going to go into a bit more detail. I'm going to go into actually planning your event you know, the whole week that you're here. You can, uh, and I'm going to leave a few really good tips in planning your week here at Oshkosh if you're coming for the whole week. If you're not coming for the whole week, if you're just coming for the weekend, hey, that's fine, I totally understand. And, and you know, some people don't have the, the luxury of taking the time off or the finances to do that. They, you know, they just come for the weekend and they're gone again back to wherever they came from on Sunday afternoon uh, when everything is really dying down. So let's get into this. All right, so if you're coming in and camping, the one thing that I didn't know last year was where do you come? If you've been to Oshkosh, you've been to the showgrounds, you might recognize this map here off of Google Maps. This would be Boeing Plaza right over here. And so then this right over here is the main, is the gate where, where you go in from Camp Scholler, right here, uh, right over here. You may not be able to see my mouse, but if you have purchased camping, then right here is where you come in. Um, like you can, like if you're coming in from the south, uh, you can get off at over here, down here by the Plainview truck stop, and then just come up the access road. And or if you're coming in from the north, or uh, you know, you, uh, Wisconsin 42, 44 rather, then just get off here and follow over there by the museum. Um, when you get over here towards this area here by the museum, it, there'll, be a, there'll be signs that say camping one direction, uh, a museum and exit the other direction. You want to follow the camping onto Pulverency uh, Road there. Uh, let's zoom in a bit and you won't go in this one but you will want to come in this one this is where you this is the drive where you come in and you register right about there um, actually no no this is the drive that if you've already registered there's a gate right here, but if you have not registered yet, if you don't, you haven't gotten your pay, your gate pass, then you come in here to Camp Scholler, right there, and they will uh, let you know what areas that you can park and you know you can camp. Uh, there are some areas that are 24-hour generators. Um, those are all right. I didn't have a problem with them, but then but then again, I'm used to run to listening to refrigerated trailer units running right next to me all night so it doesn't bother me um, the EAA website right now is obviously having a bit of a problem let's see if we can get it unstuck a few moments later okay well it seems that EAA has gotten their tech issues worked out so here we are at the EAA homepage and First thing you want to do is you want to go up to the Air Venture tab, and that'll pop up. And then scroll down here, and let's 
Let's see, where did I find it? Uh, I found it at the let's see, Air Venture Grounds. Oh, planning your trip. Okay, so planning your trip right up here. Just go ahead and click there. And like they, they have maps, they have camping, lodging, food concessions, guest services. Uh, like Christine from Plain Lady says, bring sunscreen. Or if you don't, if you do forget anything, there is a Walmart not that far away within, oh wow, shoes. Um, just a few, just, it's just a few minutes away. Uh, but here, go down here to the Air Venture app. And you can get it on Google Play or the Apple App Store. And it, they also have an online portal so you can plan on your computer from home, which we'll go ahead and do. I'm already logged in. So from here, you can do a schedule and it will take you to all of the schedule thing, you know, the items that are uh, that you can go to. Now what I like to do is I like to open up a new tab with just my schedule and then I'll put all schedule items on, on one tab and then my, uh, my schedule on the other because it is very easy. There, like, like, it, there are a lot of goings on around the showgrounds and it is very easy to double schedule yourself and one tip that I want to give everyone is when you're scheduling these events for your for your week here at Oshkosh be sure to a not only give yourself enough time to get from wherever you're going to be at to wherever you want to be because the showgrounds can be quite large uh, it can take up to 30 minutes to get from one end to the other. Uh, and B, also, um, yeah, uh, bring lots of sunscreen <laughs> because you're going to be outside. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, make sure that you're not overbooking yourself because that is very important. Uh, let's see what's, what's going on here. With, okay, so yeah, anytime that there's going to be something going on like weather we had weather come through yesterday Saturday uh, that got Top Gun the original Top Gun canceled that will also be put through the notifications uh, there is whatever you do on the on here on the web is also automatically synced up to your mobile app so let's see uh, I've already planned out my schedule for tomorrow and um, let's see yep this is all all that I'm going to be doing uh, as you see I, I don't have a whole, whole, whole lot scheduled yet for Friday uh, or even Saturday um, and that's another thing um, leave yourself time. Yeah, yeah, that's that's the real B. Leave yourself time to allow yourself to just walk around the the hangers, you know, hangar Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, and, and see the exhibitors. Talk to the people because that's what this that's the beauty of aviation is that it's people oriented. We're just a bunch of um, laid back individuals that love to get out go fly around, explore, um, and just do cool stuff. Uh, sometimes we build airplanes too, like I'm doing. Uh, speakers, that's another thing. It, if you're gonna be, if you're like in, into listening to how people do it, you know, look, different, different classes, like uh, what I'm going to be doing, here in, oh, let's see, um, like, 
Lycoming engine care and maintenance. Now that's so far ahead of where I'm currently at in the build, it's not that critical um, because Lycoming is going to have that every year anyway. Uh, but uh, so I could probably take this out, and how how I would do that is I would just click here, and I would deselect the item, and once I go over here to my schedule. You won't see it there anymore. It'll still be there. Well, that's this is on Wednesday anyway. So, um, yeah. Now, TIG welding, not something I'm probably going to need, but it's been something I've been wanting to learn about uh, because um, it's just cool. Yeah, uh, I've heard it's an art form, uh, and it, it is something that it is a skill that. Uh, can come in useful, especially building a uh, a metal aircraft. Uh, fiberglass for RV, definitely. I, I definitely want to be in that in that class because um, even though I'm building, you know, I'm just going to be starting on the tail kit. There is a little bit of fiberglass work. There's going to be even more fiberglass work that I'll have to do when it comes time to put the canopy on. Uh, and that is about it for this. Oh, uh, before we do end the video, how do you tell where your, you know, where your, your favorite vendors are going to be? Well, that is, that's very simple. Um, if you go to the Air Venture, and of course this wants to take a while, uh, tickets, exhibitors, Go to my expo. And then click get started. That'll take you to this page, which once you log in, will take you to this page. And exhibitor list. These are all just my exhibitors. There, there we go. You can click up here for my to deselect my exhibitors uh, pages. You can do go to my expo, and there is a map. Once you ex select an exhibitor that you want to check out, there's a map that get that shows you where everything is that you can print, you can send to the mobile. Well, that's all for this video i hope this was informative for you it brought some value to you and if you're going to be roaming around oshkosh this year uh 2022 then by all means if you see me just come up and say hi i don't bite promise i don't well and and if you really wanted me to it, that would just be just weird um but uh, i am planning on uh, spending some time at the van's tent i'm going to be going around to some of the other uh youtuber uh conference uh, things like um, like Jason from Rebuild Rescue is going to be hanging out at the Abadine booth. Uh, there's going to be some other things that are going on. I think Jimmy uh, from Jimmy's World is bringing his uh, Silver Bullet 310, uh, Cessna 310 down here. If he's not here already. I know Gil from um, from Build Fly Go is here. Of course, he lives just down the road in Madison anyway. Uh, so... Come on by and say hi if you see us around. Uh, oh, and also Steve Thorne from Flight Chops is going to be here. His his airplane was just painted by my buddy Jonathan from Evoke Aviation uh, and is going to be at in Boeing Plaza for tomorrow, Monday. And then it's going to be over at the Lycoming booth, I believe, uh, the rest of the show. Uh, it might be the Garmin booth, I'm not sure. But uh, see his channel for more details on that. With that, I'm going to get out of here. Uh, peace, prosperity, love you guys. Thank you for watching. And be sure to give us a thumbs up. Comment down below with anything you want to see on the channel. And also, if you haven't already, hit that uh, subscribe button. And be sure to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any more content. With that, always check your six. Peace.